Been a while since I made a video, but I am back and in full force. Uh, I had some school and some other things keeping me sidetracked from uh, getting online and making videos, but you guys can be sure I am back and in full force. Um, this is Dash from ACS, Android Creative Syndicate, and we'll be showing you guys around a, an app called Deck SMS. I'd like to big, give a big shout out to Couch Deck, who actually did create this ROM, as well as ROM Manager and other great uh, applications for our Android devices. Um, big thank you for not only making this application, but also sharing a license with us at ACS so I could do this video review and uh, get this out here for you guys. For those that don't know, um, a quick synopsis on what Deck SMS is, is an app that allows you to send messages from your phone, your phone's number, the actual number on your uh, service agreement with your service provider, and you can send that via Gmail, Gtalk, or your web browser. We have many different options, and we'll show you guys both the web options as well as your phone options. We'll start with the computer ones first. We have a couple different places that we can go to. We can either go to the straight uh, actual site itself in Deck SMS, which is right here. Uh, we can delete, we can text, or we can call right from our computers. Or we can also get a Firefox or a Chrome extension, as we see in this top right-hand corner. Sorry about the jerkiness, guys right there and if we click on this it will give us the same exact layout but popping up right there so we can have any kind of page we want open uh, right there on the side right from our extension kind of a cool little feature he did add right there same uh, features from there we can text call or we can delete that uh, messaging string if we do delete it on our computer it does not delete it from our phone and we'll show you guys on the phone as well what we have going on here let's zoom out just a little bit here Whoops. And we'll go through it. Uh, for Deck SMS, we'll just click and hold home and then go open it right there. For instance, uh, we show right here on my license, I have 378 days left. I have checked Gmail, Google Talk, and browser extensions to come through. And what we can do is manage a blacklist. You can prevent notifications from specific numbers from showing up. Um, we can remove deck SMS contacts, we can send text messages, adjust SMS dates. Um, but for instance, we'll send a text send a test message. I'm going to press OK right there. And what basically what that was saying was when you do get these messages coming through um, on your Gtalk, you're going to have to accept. If you don't accept the person that's coming through, um, it's not going to allow that message to be sent or received. So be sure you guys do accept that. But as we see, if we go to my text messages here, we have uh, this is a test message from Deck SMS. Hopefully you guys can see that. Then we go to, since I have it connected to my Gmail as well, we got this SMS received from Dash. I don't want to start that. But I can read that and it's just basically going to show me the same things up here, which was this is a test message from Deck SMS. Um, please be sure to uh, please be sure to follow your response with two empty lines to ensure proper delivery. So basically that's just going through to those two places. And third but not last, which we were talking about needing to be accepted, was through Google Talk. And this is just saying this is a test message from Dash uh, from Deck SMS. Um pretty cool feature right there in this application. Um if you notice up here it also came through on both of these as well as the second one. So basically, um, what this is allowing us to do is, if you're at home relaxing in front of the computer, why pull the phone out always to text people? Why not use your keyboard on your uh, laptop or PC, whatever you may be on? Very, very cool app. Um, hasn't caused any issues that I have uh, encountered myself personally in about the, uh, I'm going to say about 14 hours or so now that I have been using it. A uh, very, very cool app, very stable, uh, what you expect from Kausch when using any of his products. If you guys have any further questions, feel more than free to ask, and um, you can either ask those in the comments below, or I will also link you guys to where you can get the extension, where you guys can get the app itself, uh, itself right offline, as well as to ACS Android Creative Syndicate. Once again, thanks for watching, guys, and enjoy. Later.